Good day, folks. This is Omar Hosea, serving. Back to you with another battle plan. Hey, Heavenly Father, thank you for waking us up this day. We thank you for waking up the people watching this video. We ask that you protect us as we go to and from our destination, protect our families. We ask that you protect us also from your enemies and from our enemies. Protect us from ourselves. Protect us from our own ignorance. But Father, let this make sense that we may grow and become come to you as one family, one unit, one nation. By the power of the Holy Spirit, I come. And to the prophets before me and after me, I say thank you. Say la. Okay. Now, this is a video about minefields, battle of the minds, the tactics of the mind, and what's happening to the mind. So if you notice, I do not fix my problems, but I fix my thinking. Then the problem fix themselves. And that's true, because we're going to find out how that's true. All right? Peace. Here we go. Now, you notice the guy is holding his his uh, fingers to his temple and his eyes, his eye is open. But how is it that the so-called black man, brown, or whatever, is being overrun by religion, Jesus, icons, things that are tangible opposed to things that are not tangible? Why is it that we focus more on what we can see and not investigate what we can't see? And what if it that what we can see, what we can't see, we can feel, but what we can see, we have no feelings for. Like, I don't have no remorse for my brother, or if I see two children, so-called black children, or any children fighting, I don't get into it because I don't feel the need. But when, I'm, when, when my body inside is sick and hurting, and I'm fighting within myself, then all of a sudden, I want to cry out and say, hey, I need help. And that's the disease that we're talking about in the minefield. Okay? So, let's get to it. Next slide. I'm going to go real fast. Now, mind you, there's a community called Evo and Humans United. And you notice the Geno Splice. Geno Splice. Strand, rather. I will go through some fast slides. I had nothing to do with anything. Now, if you look in this new week, news week, now you see it says modifying mankind. It has a so-called black woman with these gadgets on her brain. Now, what are they infusing her with? What is the, What are they saying? What are they sucking from the so-called black woman? See, this picture is telling us a whole bunch about the, about the battle of the mind, the mind feels, uh, uh, the attack on the mind of the, the, the son of God, the, the children of the son and the son of God, the relationship. So we'll get down, down size, go next slide. And so we see the, 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 uh, the results of it right here. I'm not saying that they're good or bad or right or wrong. We're just saying the result of being of your mind being diseased. So let's go a little further. It has nothing to do with that. Okay, here we go. Now, when you look at these chemical compounds, all right, this is in the body, this is in the mind. This is a battleground right here. That's why the Pentagon it has this shape as well. Let me show you. See, you got one, or we start here, one, two, three, four, five, six. That's why they call it the Star of David or the Star of Moloch. Because Moloch, if you really think about it, Moloch is kind of familiar with molecular. Think about that. Moloch, six point star of Moloch, which this is a molecular structure, part of a compound. Facts. Downsize. Next slide. Now, when you look at the molecular structure in the compound of the DNA, and the RNA, and the histone modification in the chromosome, how they're being dissected, you have to ask yourself, how is my mind being affected? How is my relationship with other people or with the planet being affected? 
Well, if you're not a scientist, and if you're not being groomed as a child into these science, sciences, you as a common black man or common brown or brown, I mean, uh, 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 man of color or woman of color, you won't get this. Because they, they won't teach you this because you'll start to remove the idea of Jesus uh, hearing all this. It's a lie. Now, why would they go through so much trouble to use a high throughput chip slash, I mean, dash, sequence and analysis? And it says, is his tones cleared by replication forks? Coercion, cohesion remains bound in condensing chromatin when TFs are removed. Clusters round, see, this is man-made right here. It's a chip. And so this can be implanted in your brain. This can be implanted into your psyche. Next slide. Now, the biological basis of memory. I'm sorry this page is fuzzy. Let me see. I can't really get into it. But I have to get into school, so go back. But this is a real estate right here. So if you're going to buy a real estate, a house or a real estate or land, you want to buy the whole real estate, which is the whole brain. And then... When you buy that, you have a choice to manipulate the real estate where you want to build at. And so they're manipulating the memory of the real estate that is in our minds for us to never remember who we really are. Okay. Uh, you see all those pictures. So we're about to get to it. DNA methylation is the addition of the methyl group M to the DNA because the cytosine sil C. See, that's what that CH3, HN, those are what those means in this DNA strand. But if you manipulate it with chlorophyll, I mean not chlorophyll, chlorine, in your toothpaste, uh, GMOs in your foods and things like that, this becomes defective. And so you'll be weak stated and you won't be able to regenerate and you become more easy to be programmed and easier to, to war against your brain without you have without me have without them having to actually physically fight you. Next slide. And so this Alzheimer's disease, what we have, what we suffer greatly from. Let me check this. Alright. When you look at the brain and Alzheimer's disease, you have to look at the at the psyche of the so-called black people and say you, 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 you suffer from a severe Alzheimer's disease or a memory loss because it's been attacked since birth when you get all of those injections and things of that nature. They do that to you on purpose. More battlefields. Oh, sorry, these pictures are so blurry. I'm going to get some better pictures. So the human genome. Let's see if we get a... Your complete set of genetic information encoded with 23 pairs of chromosomes and in the cell nucleus plus cell cellular memory and protein strands. What if you lack protein? What if they cut the 23 pairs? Not 23 strands, but 23 pairs. So two times 23 is what? 46. Four and six is 10. One plus zero is what? So now when you do that mathematics, you have to ask yourself about what are they doing to manipulate this? And so you have your memory, your DNA, I mean your data. And you notice this right here is you get the data from the sun. And see, and when the data is being written in your DNA strand from the sun, not the sun, Jesus, but the son of God, the DNA, the melanin, it takes that writing information and it, it entwines it. And then it goes on and begins, begins, begins on to do its prop, pro, show its properties because now you're rewriting your DNA, your structure, to line up with nature, with the cosmos, with the God, with, with the prophets. But when you do not acknowledge that 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 memory or when you do not have the memory of the sun in its in its 
and his proteins and things that it gives, <laughs> you erase <laughs> your memory and your connection to God and to the God particle. See, when you're being erased from your son connection, the son of God connection, you become lost of memory. And so if you don't remember the, that you're the son or the seed or the replicas of the son, then you, you take some in a different form because that memory is gone. And so now I can implant you with a Jesus, a Pelsky Muhammad, and all these other fashions. Next slide. And so, when we get this brain caught into this order, now it develops plaque from being erased. See, because we know that our brains are electrical. And so, anytime you turn on your light or whatever, you get dust, electrical dust. So, obviously, in the brain, with a transfer, admitting information, there's dust and electricity. What they call plaque is really dust. Thus, we are stardust. Next slide. All right, got that. Uh, here we go. Now back to this video. I mean, back to this right here. Back again. What did the Most High tell Moses? I am. And if I'm in the image of God, I am six protons, six electrons, and six neutrons. So if we got six electrons, and obviously from electricity or electrons, there is some type of dust. And protons are a controllable power, but anti-protons, you can't get control it. And neutrons, neurology, that's in your brain, the neutrons, the electricity, electrons. So when, when those things are being manipulated, then so is your molecular structure. All right, let's get back, find other, these other ones. I got some other ones more in detail. Here we go. Now, this is the disease of our people. Binary fission or prokaryote. Pro okay, we have 12 minutes. That's good. So now, this is why we, don't, we can't get along. Because this is the opposite of fusion. In fusion, you come together. You got a uh, biological fusion, you got sensory fusion, uh, you got neurofusion. That comes together, but fission, is, as they, what they say is, the bacteria before binary fission is when the DNA is tightly coiled, then the DNA, the DNA us, or the melanin, the DNA of the bacteria has uncoiled and replicated. The DNA is pulled, see, when the most of is saying DNA, use black people. Or brown people, people of color. When the black people is pulled to the separate poles of the bacterium as an increased size to prepare for splitting. The growth of the new cell or the new nigger or the new black man or the new brown man cell wall begins to separate the bacterium. The new cell will fully develop resulting in a complete split. See, that's why we're split from the sun, we're split from God, we're split from each other because this is what they've done. They get a complete split from the bacterium. The new daughter cells, see our women, have tightly coiled DNA rods, rod robosomes, and plasmid. These are brand new. These are brand new organisms. You say, Jose, what do you mean by that? Well, let's go to this. Brand new organisms. Can't find the picture right now, but we'll get back to that. So let's stick to the topic at hand. So now, with these brand new organisms, they can start to develop. Uh, they can begin to manipulate this. Your melanin. See, release from white blood cell regulates the immune system in different ways. See, that's from the sun. Protect skin cells against UV damage and regulate skin pigmentation. That's from the sun. Oxidation has cell protective properties. That's from the sun. All these is from the sun. But if you don't remember your relationship with the sun, if you don't remember your relationship, 
Day and night rhythm and darkness signal in the brain released from the pineal gland controls the time of many other functions. That is pure monotonic conducted of large orchestra. So now we're no longer an orchestrated people. We are this. What the heck? Here we go. We are this. <laughs> Fission. So now we say, okay, Hosea, what's this about? We're going to get out of that and take you to this because I think my time is getting real short, so I'm going to try to hurry up. Wikipedia fission? Fusionism? Rainbow gravity? No. Fusion. Now here are the type of fusions that we can deal with. But the one we're trying to do, what we're talking about is the anatomy. Let me check time. Time check. 16, okay. This is this is basically closing. If you have any questions, let us know. So this is what we're dealing with right now. Turn it sideways. Boom. Binary fusion. Shit. I'm gonna turn it right back up. It's going too big. All right, let's see if you see that. Yeah, y'all can see that. All right, now, binary fusion, the cognitive, we're talking about the brain, remember the video was talking about the brain wars, uh, uh, mental wars. See, the cognitive process combining the auditory information received by both ears. So if me and you talking, then we need to be cognitive and fused together. Binocular vision, what I'm seeing you do, what you see me do, what we see each other do, we become fused, cell fusion, which one cell will unclear, uninuclear uni cells combine to form a multi-nuclear cell. So that means if black, brown, red brothers and sisters get together on one fusion or one agenda, then we can become a better, mm. a better, um, Better, hu better humanity. Cell fusion, gene fusion, genetic event, molecular, molecular, remember say, uh, molec, molecular biology technique. See, because molec like the blood. So gene, gene or geno or genetic is in what? The blood. And that's where they drink baby's blood because they are molecular uh, 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 demons. They thirst for blood. So, when we fuse our gene, meaning when those of us who are healthy genes and begin to practice, take, practice taking care of our bodies and remembering the sun and all its nutrients and living like that, then our fusion becomes healthy. Sensory, the process of combining sensory data originating from different sources. So wherever your source come from, we need to make sure that it's right, pure, and healthy sources. Spinal fusion, you know, two fusions joining two teeth. I mean, there's many ways to do it. Business and products. You know what I mean? The computer soft. The point is, it's a reality. That's all we're saying. It's a reality. And so we look at binaur binaural fusion. Let's see what that brings up. That right there. But it looks like my time is running out, but this is Omar Jose. Let me know if it makes sense. And if not, you know, we won't make any more videos, but if it do make sense, share it and let us know. Shalom.